renowned Clinton at Grand Beats, which has won an award for having the best thin crust pizza on the shoreline. I'm excited to be here because I love thin crust pizza. Why don't you come inside with me as I find out why the pizza tastes so good? I'm here with Mike, who is the owner. Welcome to the show, Mike. Thank you. And can you tell us a little bit about the history of Grand Abitz in Shoreline? Yeah, my, um, my mom and dad opened Grand Abitz in New Haven in 19, Mar March 3rd, 1955. Mm -hmm. And um, it's branched out all over. I'm on the shoreline now here in Quinton. My brother Rick is in North Haven mm -hmm. as Abitza Grand, and he has another place in Bethany, Grand Abitz in Bethany. And my other brother's out on the west coast uh, as Abitz Heaven in Sedona, Arizona. In Arizona, because I want to go to Arizona and shoot there. Okay. Absolutely. We'll send you out there. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and um, what's something unique about the pizzas that you offer here? You have homemade sauce. We have homemade sauce. We make our own dough. We make our own sauce. We grind our own cheese. We use all fresh ingredients. We have brick oven pizza. As you see, Friday night is busy. We have two boards going. Mm -hmm. And you won an award for your thin crust pizza? Yeah, we just won an award for 2013. It's number one on the shoreline for thin crust pizza. Wow. So, Mike, what is this pizza that Mikey's about to put in the oven? This is a small pepperoni pizza mm -hmm. with uh, fresh mozzarella, fresh pepperoni, and a 12-inch crust that we made today. We make all the dough fresh here in, in house. Every day. Every day. Yeah. And I'm going to sprinkle a little olive oil on it okay. now. Fresh olive oil on the base of the crust. Mm -hmm. It's famous for New Haven pizza. It's so beautiful already. You can tell everything's fresh because it's so colorful already. So colorful, ready to go in the oven. Okay. You know, that'll cook in eight to ten minutes. Eight to ten minutes, yep. wow. And how many ovens do you have? We got four ovens. Four ovens, because it's like non-stop around non -stop. here. Non-stop. Pizza's in, pizza's 600 out. Degrees. 600 degrees. Yeah. All right. You don't want to see me try that. It's fast. Yeah. How long on average does it take to make a pizza? Uh, on average? Yeah, like, like to actually just make it. Tonight, right, like, he'll get that done and dressed and in the oven in less than a minute. Yeah, less than amazing. A minute. Yeah. Mikey started making pizza when he was nine years old. Okay, so he's a pro. He's a pro. <laughs> and what kind of pizza is this? It's a sausage and pepperoni. Sausage and pepperoni. All right. And you shred your own mozzarella we here. Shred our own mozzarella here. Because I see how uh, wide it is. It's like yeah. ribbons, it's yeah. not like little no. pieces. Yeah. We have all the machines to do it right here yeah. in the house. And besides pizza, what else do you offer? We offer stuffed breads, mm -hmm. calzones. Mm -hmm. Then we have our dinner section over here. Okay. We have all kinds of fresh dinners, chicken parm, baked mm. ziti, homemade lasagna, Delicious. salads, grilled chicken, small empty pasts, all kinds of salads. Okay. And just, what is your perspective on Grand Beats? Well, we love it here. We come here for a lot of family occasions. Um, my parents are 89 and 90. My grandchildren are two and three months. It fits all generations. It's family friendly. The food is wonderful. It's consistent. You know, you can come here any time of day or evening and you know you're going to get a great meal. That's important. Absolutely. And what is your Absolutely. favorite dish? Oh, I think what I had tonight. <laughs> okay. The broccoli robin sausage grinder with mozzarella cheese. Mmm, sounds good. And there's yes. plenty more to take home. There is because I was busy feeding a baby a bottle. <laughs> so there's plenty left to take home. All right, thank you, Candace. But well, you've well, been coming here for 20 years. I come I here Friday. And if I go in the kitchen, they'll give me a map how to get home. Really? That's the kind of customer I am. Every Friday, like clockwork, I come here. Right. So, you, so you like the food, you like the company. Right. You like the fact that you get West Side Story translated. That's Right. This is very exciting. Owen, what is your favorite kind of pizza here? Bacon ricotta cheese. Bacon and ricotta cheese. And how many pieces do you usually have when you come? Two. Two. Really? You have a big appetite. Are you going to grow up to be big and strong like your daddy? Yes. Yes. All right. Nice answer. And daddy, what is your perspective on Grand Abitz? Uh, it's fantastic pizza here in Clinton, and mm -hmm. it hits the spot every single time. So you and can't go wrong. What kind of pizza is that? Uh, this is bacon, spinach, and clam. Okay, so you got healthy, you got your omega 3s, you have your spinach, you have your yummy, tasty bacon. It just tastes great. It That's just all tastes I care good. about. <laughs> Danny and Helene, and Danny has been friends with Mike for 40 years. So, what is your perspective on Grand Beats, Danny? Well, I come all the way from the Hamden, so it's got to be good. All right. It's excellent, and uh, I wouldn't go anywhere else. I recommend it. 
to anybody. What's your favorite kind of pizza? Any kind. Of, any? any kind. <laughs> any kind of pizza. What's your I favorite kind? Pizza. My favorite? Yeah. The garden pizza is my favorite. So your wife is very healthy. Very healthy. I like uh, absolutely. that. Absolutely. Yes, absolutely. Best pizza anywhere. Better than New Haven, I have to say. Wow. Yes. That says a lot. Best pizza. Yes. Come on down and try it out. We now know why Grand Beats has some of the best pizza on the shoreline. Come on down to Clinton, Connecticut sometime and try some of their delicious pizza and meet their friendly staff.